Hey friends, I just wanted to show you really quickly how I turned this truck, a 2011 Ford F-150 XL work package, into this truck in order to sell it and make about $6,000. This is a truck flip and I'm going to break down all the details, cost, time, how much money you make per hour if you do it the right way. It's one of my many side hustles I do, but I can only do three of them a year because that's how many you can do without having to register with the state as a dealer. So I bought the truck on Facebook Marketplace. I found it. That's what FB means. I bought it for uh, $7,000 from uh, a body shop that it was sitting in the back parking lot of their body shop for a long time and they just decided to list it up um, took it to the DMV tag tile and transfer it was around 500 bucks give or take 50 bucks it already had the like Raptor style blacked out tail lights but I got the matching headlights for $83 on eBay maybe 30 minutes to track those down and buy them another 30 minutes to put them in really quick to put those in they're only like three screws each um, the interior was trashed. It needed detailed bad. So I, I got $25 of um, chemicals and sprays from Advanced Auto. Um, took a couple hours to uh, detail the interior. Running boards were $120 on eBay. Maybe half hour to find those and purchase them. An hour to uh, put them in in my driveway. It needed some like black trim restore um, and blacked out the emblems. Uh, that just took $10 to restore all the plastic trim all around the truck. Another, uh, just a $5 can of Plasti Dip uh, to black out the emblems. Raptor bed liner, 120 bucks for the kit on Amazon, the spray spray in bed liner. And then another 10 bucks um, for uh, some primer uh, because I, when I went a little too deep in the bed when I was grinding it out, got some primer. It's a five hour job, that's a serious job, that takes a bit. Um, found a set of rent, uh, all-terrain tires and four uh, rims, rims and tires for flat 300 bucks on Facebook Marketplace. Um, uh, went out and got them, put them on. Uh, and then I just Plasti dipped the rims and uh, with a black Plasti dip and then some metalizer, uh, 30 bucks for that kit. Took about two hours to do. So it, all in, 8,200 bucks on the truck. Ended up selling it for 14,500 um, in its new condition. Um, and then I and then I was able to sell some of the stuff I took off of it. Sold the headlights that I took off of it. Sold the rims and tires I took off of it. Um, and uh, so to all in, I'm about $6,500 all the way in. And the per hour revenue on that is $380. So that's the breakdown on my most recent flip. I've already bought another truck. I most recently bought this truck, a 2014 F-150 STX. Uh, for, it was a decommissioned work truck from a, a roofing company. That's why it's got like the weird two-tone black paint on it. Uh, but I've already converted it into this truck and it's almost done and ready to relist and hopefully make about the same profit margin. You'll notice that on all my flips, they look really similar. I'm trying to do what some people call Raptor conversions. Take old XL or STX trucks and you do a Raptor style, a Raptor aesthetic on the truck. You could you could choose to make it your own aesthetic. You could, you could uh, make your own color palette, that kind of stuff. But Ford has put a lot of work into, into determining what really sells. They've tested the market, they know what people want to buy, they know what they look for. So throw your opinion about what you think is good out the door and just try to mimic those design palettes. Here's an example of that design palette on a new generation Tundra. Uh, tried to make this look like my son's Hot Wheels and made about 6000 on it. Here's that same Raptor palette applied to an earlier generation Tundra. Black it out, clean it up, and made about 3000 on this flip. Comment below if you have any questions uh, about anything more behind the scenes about doing a side hustle like this, how I find the deals, how I evaluate a good deal, how I negotiate, anything like that. And stay tuned for what I post next.